extremely important for each individual soldier to have that individual discipline. But in real life combat, right, every situation is different, right? Everyone's house, my house, your house, everything's set up differently. In the front of second, punch the door. And we're running out. Yeah, OMG goes in the back. Okay, re-barricade this door and I'm going to show you what to do. Actually, keep it open. So, what you want to do when you clear a room, right? Is this what they taught us is... First you do something called pying off a room. Where you like, do this and check every angle visible from outside of the door. To like, gauge. And you can't always do this like if the door is shut. And you don't want to break it open and lose your other minute surprise. You don't do this. So, the second thing you do is, you'll stack up on the door, so I'm gonna go here and you get behind me. And there's a thing we do when we're stacked up on the door, yeah, but we'll like, literally punch each other. But, but as I was saying, like, when you're stacked up on the door, the guy in front will punch a person behind him to show that he's ready. And then it'll, that guy will punch a person behind him until they get all the way to the back. And then the back guy will punch a person in front of him until it gets all the way to the front. And then once the front guy gets like, you don't have to punch him, but that's what we did because your adrenaline will be rushing and you get like really bad tunnel vision and stuff. So like punching somebody or like slapping them on the head really hard is the best way to do it. Yeah. And then there's a certain technique that the army uses to uh, clear rooms. Basically, they just want to have as many people in the room as quickly as possible. So once the door gets open, everybody just rushes in. So pretty much what we'll do is the first guy will like go in um, and he'll just go straight and then turn while like adjusting his line of sight to clear as much of the room as possible. And the second guy will usually go on this room, you would go like right and then turn like this and then you would watch that door and then the third guy would come in and watch this door and then anyone after that would just back up the other guys so barricade the door so that's basically how you do battle of rule six and different units and stuff too well you want to be out here with me because even though you're in defense you're going to clear it with me okay ready so instead of uh punching me you can just shoot me so the, the front guy will turn around, oh, okay, so the way Battle Drill 1 works is, I'll explain it before we go into the match, is as soon as you get shot at, everybody will have like a pre-designated line of sight that they'll be watching if you're marching in like a patrol, and everybody will prone instantly, and uh... Like, you want to gain fire superiority as quickly as possible, so usually when, like, if someone shoots at you, you shoot back at them ten times as much. And, uh, try to, like, get their heads down so you can advance on them. And then there's something called successive bracketing, where one person will cover the other while they run forward. And that person will cover their battle buddy while he runs forward. So, come this way. We're gonna practice in the street. You would shoot to give cover while I move forward. Oh, you're covered. And then you'd say advancing cover me. Advancing cover me. And then I would say got your cover. We don't want to be in the same spot. It'd be better if you were right there behind the boat. You always want to stay far apart because of grenades and stuff. So then you'd say, uh, I would say advancing Cover me. Did you say got your cover? Cover. And then I would run forward while you cover. Basically, you want to run like a couple steps, 
prone and then get back up like this it makes it harder for the enemy to shoot you because if you're just constantly running you're a huge target so you want to like bound prone bound but that's only if you're like going long distance from an open area oh and then one other thing i forgot to say was when you get shot at you will immediately yell contact and then you yell the direction you're getting shot from so front left right rear um, or you could say like 12 o'clock and then you say how many enemies and how many meters away they are so you say like contact two contact front two enemies 300 meters okay uh stack up actually you be in the front of the stack you have such hammer you knife me first and then when i knife back all right we're good Okay. Here, uh, stack up. Wait, someone's on this. Oh. Okay, um, yeah, we'll stack up on the door and rush him. You ready? You get in the front of the stack and punch the door. And we'll run out. Yeah, LMG goes in the back. Uh, okay. Three, two, one. Clear. <laughs> Medic. Is there any issue behind a shield? So enemies taking too long to push, I don't got time for this. Top cool vibes. Let's get him. Oh. Watch this wall beam. Oh, I still got the wall beam. Not the one I wanted, but... Okay then. All right, stack up, stack up. Okay. Hold on, can I? There's one on the left. Let's we'll stack up on this side of the door. Are you behind me? Yep. In right side clear. And if you see a door, you would yell, "I have a door," and then someone would say, "Like behind you." But there's only two of us, so we don't have to worry about that. I'm watching rotate. Can you get rid of the uh oh, Alright, stack up. Okay, uh one sec. Gotta reload. Oh frag. Okay, ready? Alright. I'm ready. I got left. Oh shit, oh shit, it failed. Okay. Nice, alright, are you behind me? You ready? Yep. Watching the door in the front. Is the side clear? Watching front, you take left. Wait. He's under the... It's downstairs, I had it, I think. Why is he like? He, don't tell me he hit. You, wh what the? F we're uh, not gonna frag this time. We're just gonna go in. All right. I got left. It's spawn peaking time. Watch the feed. Oh, a pistol fight. Oh, I got my 50 points. Okay. And we won. All well, thanks to Battle Drill 6. Definitely not this guy going 12 and 3. That's not why we won.